Let's see how we can run a single test or multiple tests in headless mode, headed mode, on one browser or multiple browsers, or how we can run multiple tests in parallel. We already covered the browser's installation in the previous video, so you can check that. To update the versions of the browsers, you might need to rerun the install CLI command, which is playwright install. Before starting the execution, I will add here a short wait for timeout condition, so we can have the chance to see that the browsers are opened. Alright, so Playwright can run tests on Chromium, WebKit and Firefox browsers, as well as branded browsers such as Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge. If we run the test like this, it will run by default in headless mode using the Chromium browser. You can run your tests in headed mode by using dash dash headed. For example, PyTest followed by the module name dash dash headed. To specify which browser you would like to run your tests on, use the dash dash browser flag followed by the name of the browser. For example, Let's add to the previous command Firefox. To specify multiple browsers to run your tests on, use the dash dash browser flag multiple times, followed by the name of each browser. So let's add here dash dash browser WebKit and dash dash browser Chromium. This is Firefox, then WebKit, and finally we get the Chromium. To specify branded browsers like Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge, use the browser channel flag. For example, PyTest, script name, dash dash browser channel, MS Edge, dash dash headed. Or for Chrome, let's just replace MS Edge with Chrome keyword. Now, if you want to run the test in parallel, we need this plugin PyTest XDist, for which we can set the num processes flag followed by the number of processes we like to run the tests on. And this is recommended to be set to the half of the number of logical CPU cores or to auto. To install it, just open a common prompt and type in the following. Back in terminal, now we can add to the previous command the dash dash num processes flag, and for the number of processes, I will set three. Or if we have multiple test modules, we can run them in parallel simply by not specifying the module name in the execution command, and this will run all the tests that are located under the current folder. In this case, we have this test package. And as you can see, everything works as expected. Thank you for your time, and see you in the next one. Bye.